we begin with new details on the crash of a U.S. military aircraft that killed a local service member. Divers have found the remains of five additional crew members and wreckage from the aircraft. Eight Americans were on board the CV-22 Osprey when it crashed Wednesday during a training exercise off the coast of Japan. Crews from Japan and the U.S. are still looking for the two other victims. The remains found today have not been identified yet. The first victim was identified last week. 24-year-old Jacob Gallagher was an Air Force Staff Sergeant. He graduated from Taconic High School in Pittsfield in 2017. He is survived by his wife and two young sons. As the investigation into the crash continues, Gallagher's family and loved ones are mourning his death and keeping his memory alive. News 10 ABC's Zion Dakota speaking with someone who knew him and shares what he meant to the community. A local high school football player who joined the military and passed away overseas is now being remembered and honored by the people of Pittsfield. Old Glory flying half staff at Taconic High School just days after 24-year-old Air Force Staff Sergeant Jake Gallagher died in an Osprey training mission off the coast of Japan. The airman graduated from the school in 2017, where he played as a running and defensive back for the Braves football team. Pittsfield Fire Captain James Zider served as Gallagher's coach during his formative years. He's got nothing but fond memories now. A great kid, a leader, a quiet leader, a great mentor to the young kids. Uh, when, he, when he got older, hard worker, extremely hard worker, on and off the field. Zyder says Gallagher's leadership skills made him the perfect person to serve his country, making his young death all the more tragic. It's devastating to see, especially when you're that close to when you when I've known him, you know, for, when I coached him and known him for that four, five, six years. The Pittsfield VFW heard about the fallen serviceman. Now they want to receive his body and perform a military funeral. Korean War veteran Arnold Paris heads the organization. It's always an honor to be able to do something for a family of a departed. It's another way of thanking them for their service to the country. The VFW members didn't know Gallagher personally, but Paris said they just had to honor a fellow serviceman gone too soon. We want to be able to help anyone that is interested in serving their country in any way that we can. And to know that we've got their back if if we're able to, and when they return, um, that we're here for them. The local VFW will vote on Wednesday about donating a scholarship to Taconic High School in Mr. Gallagher's honor. Reporting in Pittsfield, Zion Dakota News 10, ABC. Zion, thanks so much. Gallagher's family remembering him as an incredible son, brother, husband, father, and friend to so many, adding his short life made a positive impact on hundreds, if not thousands of people in Pittsfield and everywhere he served. They say that he lived to serve his family, his country, and the people he loved.